I hate the fall season, but I love their accessories. And you're gonna want them too. So let's check it out. I personally couldn't pick which mini tool to share this video, so instead, I'm sharing the brand itself. Because when it came to deciding which of the three I wanted to go with, they all ended up from the same brand. So starting off with the Dash, like its name, there's something about the shape that just reminds you of speed. It's small, looks sleek, and just feels comfortable even when folded away thanks to the lack of a built-in clip. However, for something a little more intense without having to go overboard, the little Main Street has that snake-like viper feel, which also really shows in its performance and handling. But folded away is one that you can clip into your pants without scaring everyone else around you. Speaking of which, the friendliest of the bunch, the Corvid, which I've got in the special edition dessert option, but even the regular models make carrying a tiny cleaver actually useful and probably the only chance you'll get to say that you've got a tiny tool in your pants and not be embarrassed about it. Vessi claims that this jacket is waterproof, so we had to do our scientific test to make sure. The Vessi Overcast jacket is the shoe company's first line of apparel that actually looks, feels, and screams comfortable. Made to actually be 100% waterproof, the Overcast jacket is one you can wear even on non-rainy days too. Designed with a loose fit, super soft fleece lining for some added warmth, and even a dropped curved hem so you can bend down with confidence. Everything a lightweight, cooler weather jacket should be and the all black out design is just an added bonus. Plus, it doubles as a great pillow on the go, or you can go full uncle mode and always have it handy. However, what we're really here for is to know whether or not I'll need to bring an umbrella ever again. So with the adjustable hood, water sealed zippers, and stretchy fabric, we tested it the only way we knew how, in slow motion. Not only does it look epic, it also actually works. So we went a little ham. And yeah, my editor definitely enjoyed this one, but inside, my dad bod is still bone dry. With the jacket being so secretly functional, they also decided to keep it simple elsewhere too. Offering zippered pockets on both sides, more than enough to store your daily essentials, and even fitting a whole water bottle too. Plus, it does come in less ninja colors too, so links and details down below. I've tested a lot of MagSafe iPhone wallets, but this one has to be the most unique thanks to this. The Phantom M wallet has a lever to pull and reveal all your hidden cards inside. They offer the option to hold as many as 13 cards and even upgrade with an air tag holder too. I've got the extra slim here with about six cards and it passed my scientific shake test without any cards slipping out on their own. Obviously the real value is the fact that it attaches via MagSafe to your iPhone and a fairly strong connection too, which is mainly thanks to the full rubber back exterior offering some added grippiness, which makes it sliding in and out of your pockets a breeze or when just holding it in the hand too. However, Phantom isn't new to the wallet game and when detached the m becomes a fully functioning wallet on its own that doesn't look out of place and when not full can store other flat items too just maybe not your daily essentials just listen to this I get the chills every time, and it feels like you're just itching your brain. The Zero One EDC slider and maze clicker is not only satisfying in the hand, but is also just wicked to look at too. Mimicking what looks like a tiny PSP, which some of you may not be old enough to remember is such a goat of a gaming console, and this is the specific variation with the added clicky buttons on top of the original slider body, making it even cooler given it's like an upgraded design. Plus, there's just something about Ultim, this plastic see-through smooth and glossy material that sort of just screams pumpkin spice latte autumn vibes, making it the perfect material option for any other Ultim fidget toy as well, from sliders to clickers and even spinning rings too. Oh. And the maze inside is actually playable too, although like your love life, you may never actually solve it. However, to match that, Dango also offers their capsule in this limited edition Ultim Finish too. And if you ever needed to carry something really tiny outside of your boxers, this is it. Now for context, it's about the size of a single AirPod, but offers full-on protection for about the size of two pieces of gum inside. Seriously, 
thanks to the tough plastic build combined with a screw off top it's overkill durability and i freaking love it to top it all off the whole capsule is waterproof too thanks to the rubber gasket which just means if we were ever in an apocalypse just know your last two pieces of gum would be a-okay but i am curious what would you put inside another group of goodies that i want to put the brand out there for bad stitch goods and their pouches clips and all things leather some generic and some more specific like this sheath for the combat beat scout medic but the money clips are probably my favorite made with what i can only determine as some of the smoothest most flexible yet sturdy leathers they've got this flat tiny blade hidden inside you know for quick cutting jobs with some motivational quotes behind back combined with a giant clip to securely hold a wad of cash then there's the odd pieces like a dice holder because why not? Everything just looks and feels better with leather anyways. The fall time is warm, but also cold, which means you never know how to dress. So carrying something to ensure you're just warm enough is a must. The Rama XO mini lighter case is technically just a chunk of metal, but they went ham on this and designed it for 2069. Able to fit in a mini Bic lighter, it essentially makes it a regular sized one, but the laser etched textures engraved on the face makes it feel like a complete tool in the hand operationally though it works and outputs the same but emotionally you definitely feel 8.3 times cooler than you would without holding it now if you were born in the 1900s you'll probably remember using one of these a pen nowadays it's become more retro tech but somehow tactile turn still manages to make it hot again literally the ember seasonal design they released this month looks like if charmander were a writing utensil and i'm fully in support as he's the only starting pokemon anyone should choose don't fight me on that we featured the bolt action pens many many times before and we continue to do so because they're that good whether it's the built-in clip details comfortable grip offered in a slim and thick boy version or just the super aesthetically pleasing color combos that they come up with combined with the ability to use standard ink refills this may cost a little more than you're used to it makes for the perfect gift but also for yourself maybe the last pen you'll ever need to buy now the bottom of my water bottle was the last place i'd expect to find a bottle opener but if you're paying these premium dollars you should get premium features the wingback 100 milliliter hip flask is technically made for other flavored liquids and if you were to fill it up with some expensive juice i can see why you'd want it to be held inside something this sophisticated looking made of stainless steel and well offering only a hundred milliliters of capacity combined with the caps rubber seal to prevent leakage of said fancy liquids this can easily slide into a pocket bag or even sling but honestly this isn't something you'd buy for yourself however it would make for an epic gift for that special someone <clears throat> yourself now this packed everyday three liter sling is well tiny but also honestly more than enough for your day-to-day -day commute when combined with the rest of your pockets around your body made of what feels like a wax nylon it's actually recycled material and is waterproof as well it's the perfect size for a phone wallet keys earphones and a pack of gum plus the top handle is a nice touch too especially given you can remove the strap and utilize it as a mini pouch instead for how small it is you'd be pleasantly surprised with how organized it is inside which to me makes this one of the best tiny sling bags that i've ever tested summer or winter let me know in the comments personally summer for me but that's it i rest my fall edc